Hopefully they get some Beo music too. Three, two, Let's see. One, oh no, Proto Man. Oh okay. no, Dark Man. Well, you know, the Umber Witch. It is a it is a dark character, so why not? It fits. <laughs> Fair enough. Listen, right. listen. Fawn would absolutely be the person with some boss music. Absolutely. All right, right now, making making John work for this percentage already 82%, and no, really no answer from John so far. John, John knows this matchup, and the matchup is you be patient until you find a way to just kill Bayo, because Bayo will have a hard time killing, as we can see here, 132, and absolutely no kill setups. Ooh. Oh, I don't know and about that. One, Up till into back air, looking looking pretty true to me. It is, fortunately, one of the only true kill confirms with Bayo. Oh, no. Nope. Gonna make it back? No! Bouncing Too off. Too fancy at 13%. That's that's another thing. John can also just wait out the recoveries. <laughs> All right, good tech in from Fawn, avoiding the header setup, but an unfortunate SD. We've been seeing uh, a couple SDs coming out from Fawn tonight. Ooh, forward air oh, is going to be a taking it. A death. So yeah, it, I mean, <laughs> if you look about it, if, or if you look at it, John has really only put on like maybe 50-ish percent in this entire game one. And he's well, he was winning. Oh no. All right, but the percentage is starting to rack up for John. Looking for some fair loops. Okay, it's all right. Bayo's gonna come back. Bayo can recover. Ooh, the Phantom on uh, the Wii Fit up tilt. Wow. Fun yes. waiting for the option from John. That really was just kind of checkmate. If we can see that last stock once again. Yes, please. Honestly, she didn't need that first stock. Yep, John gets sent out. Out stage, and you can see Fawn just waiting, like pick an option, air dodge, header, do something. If you're and ahead Fawn in, was ready. If you're ahead in like stock with Bayonetta, you have to go for those. You have to shut it down. All right, John with the Tekken music counter pick, moving on. I think still sticking with the small battlefield. John is comfortable on the stage. It's a good stage for a Wii Fit. Three, two, Absolutely. One. All right, so let's see what kind of adaptations uh, John can make in game two. Because, I mean, okay. self -destroy. Hello? Oh, okay, okay, yeah, we're fine. I mean, I, I kind of figured John was fine, but you're putting yourself oh. that far out that early. Like, you're you're really looking for something. Look, it's, it's happened to Fawn. It can happen to you, too. <laughs> I mean, it's John definitely... Character. Definitely a player with like great download speed, but that game one did not have a lot of time for John to get the download on this Bayonetta. Right. No, the Bayonetta needs to hit hard Ooh. and hit fast and always be mixing it up. And it I, I love the idea of that forward smash at the ledge to potentially catch John coming up early with the header. No way. Ooh. No way. Okay. I was about to be. That, uh, <laughs> unfortunately, that up special with Which, the hula hoops uh, does have a continuous hitbox. There's no way to punish that correctly. And John takes the first stock, even after all that work. Ooh, and the up tilt, even catching John crouching. Usually we fit crouch, able to get through anything, but the scoop on the up tilt, able to get Fawn that first stock in, keep herself in this game. It doesn't seem that John really knows how to SDI that, um, oh gosh, I forget the name of that move. But anyway, the up special. The witch twist? The witch twist, yes, thank you. Ooh, no uh -oh. tech from John getting sent off stage once again. You can see Fun ready with the timing, even having the variable timing of the uh, the ledge invincibility on lock. Looks like Fun is going for that uh, pure platinum run here. Only 25% damage. Ooh, all right. Looking to close that out early again. Didn't catch it. Still having the air dodge to make it back onto stage. Okay, if you guys noticed, uh, they held the forward smash, so the guns came out, trying to uh, catch John into a little bit of a hit stun. Yep, using, but it didn't work. Yeah, utilizing those bullet arts. Ooh, all right, bat within, keeping Fawn safe from the soccer ball. But John is finally starting to get a little bit of a lead, especially with that heal from the sun salutation. All oh, the weak spots. All right, pressuring with these guns. Chill there. All right, nothing hitting. 
John Louise. coming back. John is finally starting to get that download going, especially on this spacing. John. Woo! Oh my gosh. The on just holding the shield. But not quite finding the patience there, just running right into that Sun Sal. Okay. Woo! Nice little drop down up there. Alright, both players just playing very patiently wow. right now. Wow! Did the, you see that low profile? That's we fit crouch. <gasps> oh that's my the best gosh. crouch in the game! Bale's grab sucks! <laughs> Honestly, Ooh, the up tilt back air. you know you're a Bayo main when you come down for the platform and just forward smash. <laughs> it's your only opportunity. I mean, you've got you've got the Halo invincibility. Might as well, might as well take it. All right. Unfortunately, it looks like the difficulty just went up to infinite climax as Fawn struggles to hit anything. Yep, John finally starting to find that rhythm, keeping Fawn at bay. Ooh, not quite able to connect that up tilt. But uh -oh. gonna see if Fawn can find some more of these like super high damage combos. Well, John seems that they have uh, the DI down for that Witch Twist. <gasps> Ooh, the Ooh. parry down tilt and that deep breathing absolutely gonna be taking it, taking us to game three. Yep, the Witch Hunts aren't quite over. Bayo can bring it back. I'm definitely curious to see if we'll see a character swap from Fawn. Oh, we got some music swap, though. <laughs> Who wins? Which time or some funny hula hoops? Oh, the hula hoops. The funny hula hoops. I know Fawn is sticking it out with the Bayonetta into game three. I appreciate it as a Bayo man. Oh, unsafe opening, but I can see what they're going for there. Yep, the heel slide not able to pop the second hit on the shield. All right, John, uh, kind of baiting Fawn out off stage once more, getting getting all this uh, chip damage thanks to the hula hoop and the header. Oh, okay, interesting. You have to just uh, kind of can... trading. Wow! Ooh. Nope, they're gonna make it back. Yeah, he's making it back. And yes, the percentage just not high enough. Yeah, and especially John having a jump, he is comfortable off stage, not really phased in the slightest. All right, nice little fake out with that soccer ball, just going into the grab. Ooh, I love the what a dodge! I love the movement from John. Uh, the like the feint on the sun citation, giving him a free roll in. All right, the back air out of shield from WeFit. Not quite enough to catch the upward ABK. Oh, here we go. Forward That's air stock. sequence is going to be taking it. All right, Fawn looking good. Here this first stock. All right, John. Just backing Ooh. off, backing off. Okay. Ooh, the feints coming out with the deep breathing once again. But unfortunately, across the stage, no deep breathing. Not going to be finding Fawn's first stock yet once again. <laughs> It is unfortunate. With deep breathing, that would have killed. But, uh, oh, God, we the trainer is just a weak character without it. But and there we go. At 200%, it better. Cool. All right. Great timing from John to make it back into center stage. Not able to find the sun salutation. Ooh. Yeah, definitely still going to be able to make it back. Fun getting caught by those hula hoops. All right, going for the extended heel slide. Unfortunately, getting punished Ooh. for it. A nice little down tilt. Oh my gosh, there we go, though. One, two. All right, no buckle my shoe. <laughs> Trying to wait for another option out of John, but not quite finding it. John correctly SDIing down. Ooh, all right, another up throw conversion coming out from John, and a oh. deep breathing back air. Bayo just exploded. That killed at 81%. She's that's, so light. That's deep breathing. That just hurts my soul. <laughs> yeah, look, oh. look at this. No. What? Really? Oh, I think they were done. Just, just like that? Yeah. Man, I hate it when, I, when I'm like, I'm, I'm going to make the call. Like, oh, okay, I will show this instant replay. Surely no one will die during the time I do it. 
But right. no, we get double <laughs> replay. I like it. The replay replay within replay? No, I like your replay. Let's let's look at this replay instead. <laughs> That's a <laughs> sick replay right there. <laughs> like oh time. no, they oh I see what happened is the air dodge. Yep. Used too uh, many resources on the combo and wasn't able to make it back to ledge. Here's the thing. We can make fun of Asora for not coming back with their uh, recovery, but we, we can make fun of Veo. That is a legitimate problem sometimes. Good Very GG's there. That was going to be Fawn moving down into Loser's Finals 